This Rodeo Spotlight, powered by your San Antonio area Chevy dealers. Well, you know it is rodeo when the AT&T is transformed from a basketball arena to <laughs> a rodeo arena, bringing in the dirt. That's right. Bernie Ramirez, chairman of the operations committee, joins us. What does it take to get all this in here? It looks like a well choreographed uh, Thing. Well, it pretty much is. You know, we, uh, we've we got some contractors that bring in this dirt, and uh, they've come up from on top where we keep the dirt stored every year. And uh, we've got loaders up there. We've got people down here. So it's pretty much just running trucks back and forth pretty much most of the day, unloading, reloading, and just doing it all over again. How much dirt? 70 truckloads that are brought in during the day. And probably by around 3 o'clock, 3.30, it when, will all be in here. When did they start? About 6, 6.30 this morning. Wow, that, it, it never ceases to amaze me that yes. they get it all in yes. here. And the other thing that I don't think a lot of people realize, this is what folks see, but there's a lot of dirt underneath the stands and everything because that's where all the cattle are, right? There is, there is. So, you know, the dirt is brought up to about uh, 12 inches from the concrete. That's the depth that the PRCA pretty much requires it. Once all this dirt is, is brought in, then we will come in with all the bucking chutes, the roping end, all the panels, the bull pins, everything that it takes to, you know, have the rodeo um, will be put in place starting this evening and then pretty much most of the day tomorrow. Wednesday morning, it'll just be some final touch-ups. Uh, rehearsal will be in the afternoon and Thursday we rodeo. Wow, that quick. <laughs> now, during the rodeo, do you have to do touch-ups? you have to bring more dirt in every yeah. once in a while? Or well, what? you know, we, we groom it, so okay. to speak. Uh, we have uh, personnel that will uh, run what's called the Rotera on it and just keep it worked. We work it every day and uh, come show time, you can step out here and it pretty much looks like a brown carpet. So it's like a rodeo version of the Zamboni. Exactly. <laughs> yes. Like now the big question is, what is so special about this dirt? Because you own it, you store it out yeah. there in the parking lot yes, every yes, year. Yes, this dirt was purchased in 1988 from uh, Charlotte, Texas, not too far down the road. Mm -hmm. And um, it's stored back here. And every couple of years or so, it uh, it is sifted. And every all the impurities and trash and everything is pretty much cleaned out of it. So although old is dirt, clean dirt. Yes, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> all gets put in in one day? Does it all get taken out then in one day? Pretty much so, wow. yes. Wow. You know, uh, people uh, don't know this, but once the concert is over on that last Saturday night, um, our operations committee will come in here and tear every piece of metal that's in here down. These trucks will come in and start taking it all out. Don't right. forget the rodeo runs through the 26 here at the Rodeo Ground ATT Center, Freeman Coliseum. Clean your bucket off. Ah, okay. Stock Show and Rodeo, just head to our website, salive.com, or just click on that QR code on your screen.